Somebody down here, too? Look! The vulture! A direct hit in the tail feathers! It's out of control! Wow! I don't believe it! The vulture is really a helicopter! And those people inside it! The ones we met on the road. Then you're not really housekeepers. No, we only pretend to be in order to plant these highly magnetized steel squares inside the Adams house. We attach them to various objects which we then control from the helicopter. That explains Wednesday's levitating chair. And the mummy. And the flying carpet. Yes, we wanted to frighten the Adams family out of the area. But why? All those eerie things in that house, mummies, dinosaurs, they had a bad effect on the neighborhood children. The neighborhood kids? Is that what all this is about? Why don't you call the authorities and get this all over with? Just a minute, folks. I've got a better solution. I don't believe it. The, the children aren't even frightened. They're actually enjoying it. So is Branislaw. And the pet octopus makes a groovy maypole. Amazing. Even Bing is doing his thing. Well, you've certainly changed our minds about the Adams family. They make splendid neighbors. Are you sure you won't stay on as housekeepers? You can have the best tomb in the house. I don't think my heart can take it. Then it's time to say farewell. How triste. Triste? Tish. You spoke French. Speak some more. Soup du jour. Eiffel Tower. Anything. Darling, please. Triste now. Triste later. <laughs> Scooby wants to say goodbye to... Adios, Scooby. Au revoir, Scooby. Tish. Oh, d sorry, darling. Auf Wiedersehen, Scooby. Farewell, Scooby. What, Scooby? Don't forget thing. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> oh, sweet. Even Cleopatra wants to get into the act. Cleopatra? Poor <laughs> thing. He must be allergic to plants. <laughs> <laughs>